In this video, we're going to show you how virtual reconstruction and 3D modeling can help to sustain various architectural monuments, buildings, and landscapes. This brings us to the South Fremantle Power Station in Western Australia. Constructed in 1946 and opened in 1951, then after five years of construction the building provided power to an increasingly growing Perth and Fremantle metropolis. Employing over 250 people at its peak, the coal-powered station was eventually closed after advances in technology deemed it uneconomical. And now the disused building is listed on the Western Australian State Register of Heritage Places. Closed in 1985, the South Fremantle Power Station now resembles a decrepit shell of its former glory. Since its closure, the derelict industrial building has achieved iconic status and has extensive graffiti. The station was one of only two power stations in Western Australia to be constructed as a steel and concrete structure with extensive glazing. Both the concrete and the steel of the structure have deteriorated through the ingress of water. Agisoft hierarchical tiled model format is a great solution for building and city scale modeling of this size. The 3D tiled model allows for responsive visualization of large area 3D models in high res. And built based on dense point cloud data, hierarchical tiles are textured from the source imagery to help preserve this great structure. Talks of redevelopment of the site have included mentions as being very costly and would require experience with developing a heritage site. Some ideas include an outdoor cinema, lighting setups, extreme sports events, dinner function spaces and hotels. 